Hello, everybody. So this is where things get a bit confusing. And I don't mean plot-wise, I mean looking at the differences between the script and the soundtrack. As I mentioned earlier, Opportunity was originally around this point of the play and was moved to the beginning. But that's not the main difference. The main difference is actually that a song got cut. And that is technically the song to which I have arrived. And while I do really like this song, I don't know if I should talk about it. Because the fact is, it was cut. It's not really part of the musical anymore. It's not in the script at all. It's not even at the very end where they put in bonus things. It's almost like the song never existed, but to me that's kind of a shame. So I do kind of want to talk about this song. I probably won't actually put a snippet of it at the beginning simply because you know, it's not in the original musical, but I feel like it deserves to be talked about because I personally like it. This song that was cut is called Here I Come. From what I can tell, this is a song basically directly after the movie fiasco. And in case you're wondering what happened to the movie fiasco, we have Brett and Archie leaning in for a kiss, Lucy actually ends up pulling Kendra back, so Brett and Archie kiss each other. Which of course makes Brett very angry and he denounces Evan in front of everybody and says that nobody should have show up to his party. And Here I Come is a song sung by Evan, basically talking about how he's not going to let this ruin him. That so while this is a big disaster, he in no way is going to let it get him down. And I like this song because it does show this determination of Evan. It shows that even though things don't appear to be going right, he's not going to let him get him down. And that is really a good indication of his character in general. He does have this determination, he has this kind of pig-headedness that allows him to keep moving forward even if everything looks really bad. And also, before I wrap this video up completely, I will talk about the song that replaced this. Now this is a song that I don't actually have available to me because it's not in my iTunes library, but I do briefly want to talk about it. This song is called Being a Geek, and it is most definitely not the song full of determination that Here I Come is. But it still does reflect what Evan is going through at this time. Because Being a Geek is a song about how lonely Evan is at this time. About how he is kind of an outcast, he is a geek, and so a lot of people kind of ignore him and just shove him to the side. And at this point, everybody has basically left him by the wayside. Patrice gave up on him a while ago, but... She's even more angry at him now, if that's even possible. Brett and all the popular kids have completely abandoned him. And even Archie has left him by the wayside and refuses to talk to him. Everybody has left Evan, and so he's basically distraught, and that's why he sings this song. So, I like both songs. I think they're both very strong. I think they both fit the character. And that's why I find it difficult to talk about one over the other. I think they're both good, and I think it's a shame that one had to replace the other. So yeah, this week was confusing. And I'm not going to be promising that next week will be any less confusing, because I'm going to be talking about Opportunity, which is technically now the beginning of the musical. But I will basically just be talking about why Opportunity works where it was. So, tune in next week for that. See you then.